Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the cube but today I wanted to thank you guys for all the kind words in the last episode I really really do appreciate it like I said I've just been kind of out of it for reasons I stated last episode uh, but today guys I got this book now if you guys didn't see last episode go check it out I really recommend it and also we got this book from Meg Frostwalker 2 I have never had a Frostwalker book before, and I'm very curious to see how it goes. I don't want any of this. I have more than enough bones. I've been trying to save up bones lately just because I like to gather as much, uh, what's it called? The wheat and that kind of, what the heck? Wheat and that kind of stuff as possible. What the hell? Oh, you know what? You know what we did? Okay. We updated to 1.10. That scared the crap out of me. We updated to 1.10 today, and I haven't played on 1.10. And there's this thing that makes you automatically jump. I do not like this. I mean, I could probably get used to it, but I... I... No. No, you can't make me use this right now. That's too much. Oh, wow. I was actually expecting, like, a full, like, five minutes of me searching through that, just barely missing where the auto jump is. But, nope, that's easy enough. Okay, so we don't have that anymore. That's something that, like... Okay, in my mind, it's pointless, but I know in the future it's going to be something, like, mandatory that I'm going to need. And I feel like that's what's going to happen with it. Um, so what we're going to do is we are going to make the ultimate boots. But, well, I don't know if it's the ultimate boots. It's kind of a uh, preference, if you know what I'm saying. I'm moving my mic up. It's going to make a weird noise. No, I think we're good. Uh, it's going to be kind of preference. What we're going to do is we're going to make this bo these boots again. Uh, protection with all that stuff. But we're going to take out Depth Strider because it's not going to be necessary at all. And you know what? Now that I'm thinking about this, I don't think I have any mending books. I'm almost positive I don't have any mending books. Oh, I am going to have to go to the magic mending villager, aren't I? Oh, no, I hate that guy. Well, let's get everything else beforehand before we go over there and talk to him. Uh, no, that's not how you craft things. That's how you <laughs> you fix things, HBOM94. So now we can just throw you on there. It should be just Frostwalker 2. Beautiful. That's what I'm talking about. And then we're going to need protection 4. Boom. Uh, I'm breaking three would be amazing as well. I'm going to have to go through all. Of, I don't want to use that one. I'm breaking three. And then what else would I need? Um, I could just look at my other ones, but I know that there's going to be something I'm missing. What am I missing? What else? Feather falling four. Feather falling and mending is what I need last. But I don't know if I have any feather falling four. This drives me crazy whenever I do this on camera. But I've narrowed it down. There, I'm pretty sure there's a, 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 a feather falling. Feather falling. There, come on, where are you? For real, I don't have one? What is... I have to have one. I, I have to. Do I have a feather falling three book? Really? What have I been doing with my life? This is my job, HBOM94. You're supposed to have all of the books necessary in order to do a feather falling perfect boot set. Come on, H. Okay, let's look in here. We might still have it. Protection 4. No. These all have, like, so many enchantments on them that I have to make sure that I don't accidentally skip over it because I know that's something that I would 100% do. Uh, feather falling. No, 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 no. God, why? I have every enchantment known to man. But Feather Falling, apparently. Feather I did. I forgot. I do actually remember that I had a mending book in there. That works as well. Come on. Okay. Well, I think we're going to have to do some enchanting as well. Because I, I don't want to wear boots unless they have Feather Falling on them. Especially like, okay, I don't know how. Okay, we're going to have to test out how Frostwalker works because I've never done it before. And I also want to see what's going on with 1.10. I have no idea, no clue. What's like the good things in 1.10? That took so many levels from me. Like, I don't know what's new. I'm going to Google it, and then I'm going to do some research, and then we're going to mess around with it as well as I put mending on here. Okay, good. We have 27 levels still, and we need, what was the last thing? Feather Falling 4. I'm going to double check here because I feel like I do have it somewhere. Okay, I have Feather Falling 2 at least. God, really? Feather Falling 1? Oh. Oh. You know what? This is the start to something something magical. We can make a Feather Falling 3 book. Give me... No, no. I knew I was about to do that wrong. I knew it for a fact. Feather Falling 2 and Feather fall. So we have Feather Falling 3. Now we still need Feather Falling 4. It's finally time that we try and grab it. So I've been sitting here g gathering XP for way too long. Um, and I do have Lapis. You know what? No, I'm not going to do it. I was going to say, let's make another pair of boots in case I get Feather Falling 4, but I would have to get just Feather Falling 4 diamond boots, and that would be it. 
And I'm not sure if that's even, like, enchantable. And then also, like, I already put my Frostwalker 2 on this one. So we need to get a Feather Falling 3 book or better. We can always get uh, Feather Falling 1, 2s and try trading. I was going to start trading up. I've been playing so much CS lately. Um, dang it. What am I doing? I want the Unbreaking 3. Um, we can combine them. <laughs> that's the word I'm looking for. Efficiency, knock, but let's just do sharpness. I'm going to try and get as many opportunities as possible on this. We're not getting lucky at all. Aqua Affinity isn't bad for one level at all. Protection 3. Come on! Level 30. Uh, 40. Uh, I'm at level 42 right now. I'm still taking these these protection ones. They're not bad at all. Efficiency 3. Protect. Come on! Like, this is just good. I feel like I'm just not going to get it. I really do. <gasps> Never mind. I do have some great news. I do not have a anvil around here. A an advil. A a I was about to say Advil. Anvil. <laughs> so I need to go back to my other base. All right, we should be good. We're back here at our base. And I've been looking up what exactly is new in 1.10. And there's not much, to be honest. What is this? Feather Falling 3? Oh, yeah, I had Feather Falling 3 as well. Boom. There's not much new stuff other than... I think there's, like, new blocks in the nether. There's polar bears. There's new zombies. I don't know how to see the new zombies. And apparently they're not that special. I, uh, wow, I have one level left after that. I didn't even tell how many levels that costed me. Um, but there's nothing too great. But I think what we're going to go do is explore the nether once we put on our, our this one. I'm going to put that on when we get away from water. I have a question before we continue. Is this going to ruin my crops? I, I don't, the reason why I'm scared to use this around my base is I don't want it to, oh, go, stop. No, I don't want it to ruin that stuff, the flowing water. I know it's going to decay, right? Donkey Kong. Decay. <laughs> get it? It was a funny joke. Yeah, I know. I have been running around this desert seeing if I could get one of these guys to spawn. And I actually did. Do you do anything special? You give me hunger. If I kill you with looting. Okay, I killed him with looting. I did. Nothing special happened, but there is water over here that I want to try out as well. Do I have the... No, that's Depth Strider. I want this one on. There's water right here, so this should be interesting. I don't think that guy does anything special other than do that. I, <laughs> I'm i going to be like Jesus and walk on... This is so cool. This is honestly just like one of the coolest things, and it's already starting to decay back there. That's so sick. Why did I fall through the water? Okay, a little glitchy. Yeah, okay, so you can't jump on the ice, which... Kind of sucks, but it's not the end of the world. Let's see if we can just get over to the south side really quickly. Are we building a rocket ship or something over here? I just had the longest, like, cough attack I've had in a very long time. I'm, like, sweating from it a little bit. Are we? I don't know what this is. Oh, oh, there's signs. Signs. Teach me what you're building here. Watch out. The future north side radio. But yours true. This is just a radio. It's not even a radio station. It's a radio. Let's see what this sign says. Poke. Def you have nothing. What is the point of these chests, poke? There's nothing in the chest, poke. Nothing. One of these days, I swear I'm going to sit down and finish that. I want to finish it. I just, I haven't been motivated enough to do it. <laughs> I just need the motivation to make myself to finish the freaking, the surfing challenge thing. So how am I supposed to? Okay, so this is an issue. Um, I don't know how exactly I'm supposed to do this, but let's try getting up. I know this axe isn't going to make it go any faster, but I've already dedicated myself to doing this. I, I don't know how this is going to work because like you have to, Oh wait, no, if I, if I, I didn't even realize this, if I break this block, there's a cobblestone block right there and then I could go on the ice, but it doesn't work perfectly. Obviously not. Can you, thank you. There we go. A bit glitchy, but it does seem to work. It's very, very awkward. It's so cool. It's so weird at the same time. Like, it's not something that you expect to see in Minecraft, is it? I feel like it's one of those mods that's like the Jesus mod or something. Walk on water. Turn water to ice. No, it's an enchantment for your diamond boots or just boots in general. And it's like impossible. Well, I like that it's like impossible to get. Well, not impossible, but it's just very, very rare to get. Are we getting near it? This I, I'd re much rather just take the nether. I'm realizing this now. I can't even like run jump. I'm just slowly going on ice. And I'm also not running because I'm not eating. We should be getting actually very close, though. We're past Peace Island, which Peace Island's, like, right in the middle of us. Like, this is awesome. This is so freaking cool, but I don't see it as a good thing or a bad thing, if that makes sense. There's no one on the server either. Like, I don't see it as, like, major, like, game-changing or anything like that. It's kind of nice, I guess, in PvP. Uh, I think Death Shredder would still be better. 
Yeah, no, Depth Strider is still better. And what we're going to go do now is I'm going to go to my nether portal to the mushroom biome, and I'm going to go a little bit further out and see if we could find some newly generated chunks or something cool like that. And if you don't understand what I mean by that, like the newly generated chunks. Hey, red sand. Someone was at the mesa. Maybe. Oh, that might be leading to the mesa. Um, newly generated chunks should have the new blocks in there. Obviously, the blocks around here. Why? Is that all for the mesa or something? I'm very confused about. Why is there Enderman? How did no that's part of the new update enderman now spawn in the the nether now oh, i forgot about that that's a gr game breaking <laughs> it's monumental news but i'm gonna go to the mushroom island and or not the mushroom i'm gonna go past the nether portal i'm i'm off today i have some good news and i have some bad news the good news is i found the stuff the bad news is it's all the way down there I don't know how to get maybe I could just dig down I'm, I'm terrified I'm terrified of this kind of stuff let's just go this way a little bit and then we'll dig a, like right here just dig like that down just go down I could take a bit of fall I have feather falling four on so I should be fine okay yeah I'm definitely gonna be fine from right here let's see if I could go one more down okay I can oh we could even go even more. I, I can't resist quartz I'm sorry I've been gathering it all the way over here too ever since I did the K the the thing for grape I've been obsessed with gathering them boom um, I'll resist. <laughs> That's easy stuff to get. Oh, come on. For real, it has to be... Why? It just has to be that, like, river of lava in the way. Don't die, H. Don't die, H. Don't die, H. Don't die, H. Oh, thank God. I think if I, like, step on these... Oh, I just take damage. I thought I was going to be set on fire or something like that. Because I knew there was something weird with them. This is Fortune 3, and I do have Silk Touch. I think I'm just going to try the Silk Touch. What are you called? The Magma Block. These are very easy to mine as well. This is efficiency three. I like building with this kind of stuff. Well, actually, no, I prefer nether, nether rack still. But hey, this is still kind of nice. And this is a good. How much damage does this do? Wow. Maybe soon enough, I will take half a heart of damage. Literally, it does no damage whatsoever. Okay, it's not as cool as I thought it was. Can I do anything like crafting wise? No. Like, in my mind, I thought this was going to be, like, an end game thing where it's going to be like, oh, you need Silk Touch in order to grab it, and then you could use it on your enemies or something like that, where it's, like, super cool. It's like you could kill your enemies that try to break into your house right away or just something sick like that. But no, it's just, it's whatever. It does no damage at all unless they have, like, no armor on. Let's see how, let's try, let's try just taking off everything but the diamond chest plate. Still unamused. Still very unamused, to be honest. I don't believe there was anything else in the nether for me, but we do have these nether bricks. And now what you can do in freaking Minecraft is no longer do you have to have all those nether wards anymore. You can now put them into a block. Wow. Game-breaking stuff, Mojang. <laughs> I'm kidding. It's cool. It's very nice. It's it's just a little underwhelming. I'm not gonna lie, but hey, we got this now. This is a lot cooler, actually. This is a, a nether. Wait, what is this called? A red nether brick. So it's like a little redder nether brick version, and it costs less in general uh, than the normal uh, nether brick block because normally that takes four four nether bricks, and that only takes two. And nether wart nether wart is a lot easier to farm. A lot easier to farm than nether bricks because all you have to do is smelt nether wreck and that's very very easy and all that kind of stuff so that's the kind of new stuff out of there um i i, I want to go search for a polar bear but i feel like i'm just gonna get my my i'm just gonna get disappointed i think we're gonna do that next episode i want to find a polar bear i want to get him but i don't know how i'm gonna bring him back to be honest so joe just contacted me and said he wants to do a gambling bit and he came up with a genius idea of having a sheep go in one of the directions and we place a bet on where the sheep goes. I, yeah, I don't know what to say, but Joe really wants to do it. It sounds funny to me, so let's go do it. Yeah, I have to hide. Hey, hey Joe, you're not doing a very good <laughs> job of hiding. Hey, you should <laughs> you come back need... up here. All right, fine. What are we doing? So I have this gambling game set up. You ready? I'm so excited. You said I you love want... gambling. Yeah, Joe said he wanted to start gambling, and I'm like, yeah. okay. And then I asked what game he had in mind, and he wanted to see which way the sheep would go. So I took it a step further, and we're oh going to no. see which what way the this? chicken goes. Oh, my. You literally just stole my idea. I said, sheep, you do chicken. Come on. 
All right, but we, why why'd you go and throw me seeds? This is why cheating. are you not taking damage? Unshift. What do you mean? What? Unshift. Oh. If you shift huh. on that thing, you don't take damage. What the yeah, hell? Yeah, you don't you don't take damage. That's kind of cool. I didn't know that. Because yep. maybe like oh, because you're fragilely walking across lava, maybe. I don't know. That's kind of. But weird. if you walk, you're like crushing it. You know, maybe. I, I have no idea. I'm. You don't just, lose I'm weight when you shift, Joe. <laughs> yeah, you do. Half of it goes into your head. Oh, head is part. You know what? Well, let's <laughs> just do this. How many? How many diamonds do you want to bet? Uh, none. I have to go to an ender chest. I, I, I have literally nothing. Because you pulled me into this clip before I was ready. I because was like, I'm hold tired, on, I gotta go get Joe. some stuff. You're tired, so you made me I'm tired not... of your attitude. That's what oh. I am. H, you know what I'm tired of? My attitude. No, I'm I'm tired just in general. Oh, dude, go take a nap. No, oh, yeah. I mean, maybe. I, I mean, you need your sleep. Oh, that's uh, not my I just, under chest. I just, yeah, I just looked in there. I don't have diamonds. Can I borrow? No, that's not how this. That's not how gambling works. Please, bro. please. Ah, oh, murder behind you. Watch out. Wait. wait do you oh, call everything murderers. All right, come here. Yeah. If please, I win, then you have to go get it. Okay. All right, all right. Yeah, fair. So, so if, I didn't even grab the diamonds. We'll worry about that later. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right. Uh, but if, well, how many do you want to do? How much diamonds do you have? Um, hmm. All right, let's, let's, let's limit ourselves to 10. Okay. That's it. So yeah, we'll, we'll max you can win is 10. Um, but let, let's just start with like a, a two diamond bet. Two, two diamond bet. We're not going to do this over and over again, Joe. This is a one time right. thing. Fine. Five diamonds. 10 diamonds. No, five, seven. 10. Compromise nine. nine. Oh, all right. So a block. There we go. That's a good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All there right. you go. So we're gonna break it. Uh, which which two blocks are you gonna call that he goes on to? I'm. Well, you. We have to break all sides, right? Yeah, we're gonna break them at the same time. Like you'll go over here and break these two, and I'll break these two. All right. So how, here's what we'll do. You can only call one side, and if he goes to the side that neither of us called, then it's a tie. Um, oh wait. Do you want to just do it so that we break one block each? Um, one block each, but so then that he can't even to get go out. through one of them. So. Oh yeah, I guess that could work. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Okay. That, that way, there's always a winner. All right, I'm gonna break this side because I think he'll come to this side. All right, I'll break <laughs> this side then. Yeah. You ready? All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. <laughs> come, on, come on, chicken. Baby. Come on! Come on! Nine diamonds on the line, baby. <laughs> this is the stupidest thing. I really thought I had seeds <laughs> in my inventory, and I got really excited because I got so cheated right there. <laughs> Come on, hop Joe, this way. This Come is the on. best game ever. He pooped game. an egg. <laughs> yes! <No>! Nine <laughs> diamonds. I love this game. <laughs> Screw you, chicken. Gosh. All right, all right. Double or nothing. How do we double? Okay. Double or nothing. Eighteen diamonds. Or nada. Wait, you don't even have any. You know what? Okay, fine. Let's get them back in there. All right, I'm gonna pick the same side. Same side again. Double or nothing. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Yes, yes, yes. Come on. <laughs> He's looking this way. Come on. Yo. Come on. I no! regret doing this clip no! with you. I really. Please. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why is this Please. a gambling game? He's gonna do it. He's gonna do it. He's looking this way. He's gonna do it. Joe, he's gonna do it. It's come a on, chicken. Baby. Come on, baby. He's just gonna turn around and walk to the other chickens. No, he's gonna turn this way and he's gonna walk to me, jump right into my arms, and say, "Here's your diamonds, Joe." I mean, come on, Joe. If he does do that, you get no diamonds. It's even. I know, but I I need to even out. I don't want to lose 18 diamonds. Like, come on. Okay, you know what? I He's not moving at all. If he doesn't go in the next like ten seconds, let's do another block as well. All right. I, oh, you know what? No, right. no. We'll just get rid of the the other block, like the okay. Other one all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good call. Good call. Oh my. He he's looking me right in the eyes. He knows he wants <laughs> to go this way. He's intimidated by your mustache right now. <laughs> no, he wants to come this way. He likes my mustache. Come I think on. he's intimidated by it. Okay. Do you want to just break the other block? Yeah. Break the next block. Here we go. Three, two, one. Break it. Come God, on. this is great. I feel like he's gonna walk towards your direction. I hope so, Joe. Come on! This is great, Joe. Walk this way! <laughs> All right, there, Come Aerosmith. Come on! This is the most difficult decision he's ever had to make. He knows what's at stake right now. Don't. You're looking the wrong way. Rude. <laughs> he's looking it's the wrong chicken. way. Here we Why go. Why is he he's not like... moving? Just move. I know. <laughs> he's literally just sitting on this one block. Wait, Joe, like, hide, look... hide, hide. Make sure he can't see you. Why? Because maybe he just, maybe he's like talking to you and doesn't know it yet. He's talking to me and he doesn't. All right, you have to get off that block. You're attracting him. No, he can't get off see that me. Block. He is. He's looking directly at look, you. Look, he, he can't see. See, me. his head's following you. He 100% sees you. 
Yes, no, yes, he's he, not. He, he's staring right at you, you liar. I, maybe his head's in a different place for... Okay, why is he not moving? The first time we did this, he moved in like 10 seconds. This time, he's like, yeah! Okay, there you go. Yes! I'm super glad that that... Oh, he's going with the other chickens. Bye, buddy. Oh, wow, okay. He just went back to his family. Okay, that was... <laughs> Screw that chicken. All right, well, that was a great gambling bit, Joe. <laughs> what an awesome game. I loved it. Let's we do it again, again sometime. sometime. Yeah, that was fantastic. Bye, H. Bye, Joe. Wasn't that a great clip? Anyways, <laughs> it was the most random thing in the world. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like. I think next episode, we are going to go look for a polar bear. And also, tomorrow, we have a brand new series coming out. A very, very short series, but a very, very fun and funny series that I hope you guys will enjoy. It includes one other member of the cube, and it starts with G and N with razor i think you could figure out from that but anyways guys i hope you enjoyed if you did be sure to leave a like get out of here <gasps> you knuckleheads